According to Ministry of Health, obstetric fistula is an abnormal opening between a woman's genital tract and urinary tract or rectum. This one leads either to uncontrolled leakage of urine or stool or both through the genital tract. It is a devastating kind of disease. Dr. Wasomoka says that direct causes include prolonged obstructed labor or it could happen as a result of a delivery intervention. Some of the predisposing factors that cause fistula include cultural practices, poverty, being delivered by unskilled birth attendants and not attending routine antenatal care. Mothers actually delay to seek for care and by the time they come um, uh, to, uh, to our healthcare facilities they are already exposed to this uh, injury. If you have a mother having uh, a prolonged process of childbirth, what we call prolonged labor, chances are so high that uh, by the time this baby will actually be uh, moved out of uh, that pelvis, will have already caused injury unto the surfaces of uh, the woman's uh, reproductive system. Dr. Bahatunjile says Uganda registers about 1,900 new cases every year, with Buganda, Ankole and Lango regions having the highest number. However, the country does not have enough obstetric fistula surgeons. There are only 25. Uh, for you to become a fistula surgeon, you have to undergo some element of a specialized training for you to be able to attain the skill set that is required for you to conduct uh, fistula repair. And uh, it's uh, one of the things that uh, we are now seeing to, uh, we're seeking to encourage amongst uh, our practitioners that are both uh, general surgeons but then also obstetrician gynecologists to ensure that uh, we enhance this capacity. Women who experience fistula suffer constant shame, social segregation and health problems. The ministry says it's scaling the goal for antenatal care and emergency obstetric care among other interventions. Our mothers should be able to attend antenatal care where all these uh, messages are, in, um, uh, are passed on unto them. It's uh, through antenatal care that we do what we call birth planning. A mother is assessed at that, period, uh, at that point in time to determine whether actually they will be able to deliver a baby normally or not. As per the Uganda Demographic Health Survey of 2016, between 75,000 and 100,000 women are living with obstetric fistula. Nobat Atkunda, NTV News.